one, like it is within hundred, like you have to write hundred fifty words, or task two, two and fifty words. What's the easiest way to know that we have crossed that mark? Oh, very interesting. So, uh, what you can do is you can take a sample answer, answer sheet, download from internet, print it, and write. So, ask your learner to write because your writing may be small, somebody's writing may be big. So, ask them to write and count on an average words per line. Mm -hmm. So, once you know how many words a learner is writing per line, they just need to target number of lines. So, if you want them to calculate, uh, say, 150, word, 150 words and it is going to fit in uh, 12 lines, let's say. So, they can just mark 12, they will just mark uh, two little star or star marks. So, they know that, okay, you are at So, uh, do you have the second question then? Yes, sir. And what if I exceed or what you do? Yes. Yeah. So please ask that second question. Uh, can we exceed more than 150 or 250 in task 2? You can exceed in both, but that's not required. You neither get extra marks for that, right? And there's no, no, no benefit you get. Actually, the whole uh, word limit is set so that you are more effective, right? But if you write less words, your marks will get better. Oh, it's yeah. yeah. It's a marks minimum. Minimum. That's what's written. Minimum. Read your instructions. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Any other question? No. Okay. So, bridge.